Councilmember Weimer, I guess we just have the one ordinance. We have one ordinance that we spoke about this morning. It's an ordinance amending Whatcom County Code Title 20 to modify the dates of seasonal restrictions on clearing activities from September 1st through April 30th to October 1st through May 31st. That's the motion that's on the floor, and I'd like to move to amend to make it October 1st through April 30th. Uh, I got a note from the uh, attorney and the clerk that uh, because this did go through the planning commission and adding a month does change uh, the nature of the ordinance. We do need to hold mm -hmm. this over for a hearing. What is the appropriate motion to to hold over for a hearing? Okay. Well, not if I move to reconsider. I'll move to reconsider the amendment. Okay, Councilmember Brenner, is that a, am I doing this right? Okay, so Councilmember Brenner has moved to reconsider the amendment. Uh, any further discussion on the motion to reconsider? All those in favor, signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed? Okay, the motion to reconsider passed seven to zero. <laughs> okay, so we're back to where we have, have an ordinance uh, being moved by the committee, and I'm going to move to amend the ordinance to extend the date, uh, I'm sorry, decrease the date of the seasonal clearing ban uh, and change it from October 1st through May 31st to October 1st through April 30th. Any uh, discussions on my amendment? All those in favor, favor signify. Hey, hey, oh, oh, I'm sorry. I look, I'm not going to change yeah. my vote. I, I'm going to uh, vote against your amendment. But I just, for the public's sake, this has gone through since I've been on the council three changes already. Uh, I'm perfectly willing to go with this. This is adding another month. See how that works. And if May is, in fact, you think a good month, let's get some data. Let's get some information that demonstrates that. I, I personally didn't like the pictures uh, coming before see. us. It didn't, you know, mean that much to me. It could have been one day's deluge for all I know or a flooded basement. But uh, the point <laughs> is uh, I don't think any of us has the significant information to make a month change at this time, uh, but I'm not that overly wrought to make a, a, a vote against the whole thing if I should lose on that. Councilor Mary Kirshner. The phosphorus in Lake Whatcom does not affect the drinking water quality. Our drinking water is in the top 99% in the nation. Phosphorus affects the lake, not the drinking water. Okay, and I'll respond to Councilmember Nelson by saying uh, the pictures didn't mean as much to me because those could have been taken in August. I mean, I'm not saying they were, but uh, I'm saying there was in a August. well, there was That's a deluge. <laughs> yeah, there was a deluge in, yeah. in July this yeah. last year. So, um, you know, to me, that's very anecdotal. Uh, someone said it earlier. Uh, we're not basing it on science. We're basing it on kind of a gut feeling here. And uh, but we don't need to carry that. Yeah, okay. All right, so the motion that I've made is to amend this to change the clearing ban dates from October 1st through May, I'm sorry, through April 30th. Is there any further questions or discussion on the motion to amend? Okay, all those in favor signify by saying aye. 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 All those opposed? No. no. Okay, that motion fails with uh, Kirshner, Crawford, and Knudsen in favor. So now we have the original proposal that came out of Planning Commission and out of the Planning Development Committee to make the new dates from October 1st through May 31st being the seasonal clearing ban. We need a roll call on this. Barbara Brenner? Yes. Yes. Sam Crawford? Uh, reluctantly, yes. <laughs> Kathy Kirshner? No. Bill Knutson? Yes. Ken Mann? Yes. Ward Nelson? Yes. Carl Weimer? Yes. Okay, the motion carries six to one with Kirshner opposed. Um, uh, ne I, next item is an ordinance clarifying and revising the definition and standards of accessory apartments and second cooking facilities within Whatcom County's zoning code. And you sh all should have um, a revised version. Substitute. 
Okay, substitute that's the version. Greenish gray. And it's greenish gray. So what was the changes? Um, the changes are all marked. The, the biggest one was uh, the definition of uh, wasn't cooking facility. Yeah, it's on, it's on the uh, it's not marked, but it's on the first page, and it's that paragraph starting with line sixteen. Yeah, I got it, I got it. Can I just interject something? Yes. Um, the RCWs are pretty clear that when you make changes to a recommendation from the Planning Commission, you need to have a public hearing, your own public okay. hearing. Okay. It doesn't say substantive changes. It just says changes. Okay. So the appropriate motion then would be to move to hold this over for a hearing. Is that correct? So on both these issues, we're going to have to hold them over for a public hearing? Okay. Make changes. So um, I guess we need to uh, hold items five and six over for a public hearing then? Yes, Council Member uh, Knudsen moves to hold, uh, well, let's do them one at a time. Item five, uh, which is the ordinance clarifying and revising the definition and standards of accessory apartments and second cooking facilities within Whatcom County Zoning Code Title 20. Uh, you're moving to hold that over for a public hearing. Uh, that's correct. Okay, any questions or discussion on that item? 